I owe ten dollars to a grady. Once I had a neighbor seem sweet as honey, and whatever he possessed he said was mine. I had sickness for a time and short of money, so I call on him who seems so super fine. Oh, I owed ten dollars to O'Grady, and you think he had a mortgage all my life. Every morning he would call around to see me, and at night he would send around his wife. When I get back to work, he would ask for payday. I told him and said they'd held two weeks back, and he said there must be something very rotten when they'd hold a fellow's money back like that. But still he'd call and see me every morning. My every action he just seemed to know. And his other friends all seemed to smile about it. And I said, there's nothing but O'Grady slow. Oh, I owed ten dollars to O'Grady. And you think he had a mortgage on my life. Every morning he would call around to see me. And at night he would send around his wife. Well, at last my payday come, plus full and blooming, for I worked all over time that I, that I could, as I never cared to see your Grady's funeral, so I paid him back in full with interest good. So I owed ten dollars to a Grady, and you think he had a mortgage on my life. Every morning he would call around to see me, and at night he would send around his wife. Boys keep away from the girls I see. Love, it is a very funny thing. It catches the young and the old. It makes you feel like a freshwater eel and causes your head to swell. Your heart, it will flutter and many things you'll utter for you think that everything is going well. But you're deaf, dumb and blind on the fault and kitty find until you are delivered from her spell. So boys keep away from the girls I say and give them lots of room. For mind when you wed they will bang you till you're dead with a bald-headed end of the broom. When a man falls in love with a little turtle dove, everything is new. He will kiss her for her mother, sister, brother till her father comes in view. A gun from his pocket, a trembling hand to cock it to blow away his giddy little brains. It's loaded so he doesn't, and his darling says he must, and they're kissing one another once again. When she gets in your power, then you are busy all the while. You will linger all around her under jaw with such a silly smile. She winks, laughs, and giggles like a kangaroo wiggles, for she always likes to have you come her way. She will sing, she will dance, yes, and take a trip to France. Then you will come home alone some rainy day. So boys keep away from the girls, I say, and give them lots of room. For mind when you wed, they will bang you till you're dead with a bald-headed end of the broom. Oh, when you have sixteen half-starved kids and must wear second-handed clothes, and where to turn for the next meal and wearing a plaster on your nose, the butcher comes along with a gun, dog, and song to collect his bill. You don't know where to turn. You have little honey, but you haven't any money, and your face is red as fire, short as burn. Say, just watch them when they go down street, for you will say that I am right. For to see everyone that passes, whether morning, noon, or night. They are out for a walk, and oh my, my how to talk. Yes, their tongues run like a fanning mill, you know. How they flirt, how they tease. And are very ill at ease. Watch your step, my boy, and near them never go. So boys, keep away from the girls, I say, and give them lots of room. For mind when you wed, they'll bang you till you're dead with a bald-headed end of the broom.